hey what's up guys welcome back to this video in this video we're going to solve this question reverse link list we're given a head of a link list this is the head of this link list we have to reverse this link list so if we're given this link list we have to return this link list four three two one and now so if we're given this link list we have to return this link list this is the head of reverse link list this is a famous coding interview question now let's see how to solve this coding question we're given the head of this link list this is the head of this link list we're going to use three pointer to solve this problem pay pointer will point to null node initially pay pointer always just points to the head of reversed link list at this point our reversed link list is in null that's why prep is pointing to this null node current pointer will point to the head node and another pointer temp will point to the head node initially now what we're going to do we're going to move temp to the next of current so let's move temp to this node this is the next of this node one so temp will point to this node now we're going to apply a formula current dot next equals to prep if we apply this formula this link will be disconnected this one this node one will point to this node now then we're going to move prev to current and current to temp now current will point to this node and prev will point to this node at this point we see that this is the head of reverse link list like i said before prep pointer always just points to the head of reverse link list at this point this one this node one is the head of reverse link list now what are going to do we're going to move temp to the next temple point to this node now we're gonna apply this formula current that next equals to prep so it will point to this node and this link will be disconnected now we're gonna move prep to current and current to temp so prep will point to this node and current will point to this node now let's apply this same procedure now we're gonna move temp to the next node temp will point to this node now we're gonna apply this formula current dot next equals to prep so it will point to this node it will be disconnected now we're gonna move prep to current and current to temp now let's move temp to the next node temp will point to this node and current dot next equals to prep it will point to this node now we're going to move prep to current and current to temp now we see that current pointer is pointing to null node when you find out current pointer is pointing to a null node we'll return the node where prep pointer points to so if we return this node 4 that means we're returning the head of reverse link list so we are returning this link list four three two one now this is how we can reverse a single link list iteratively this is called iterative solution hope you've understood how to reverse a single link list now let's code up this problem
let's create a function reverse this function takes a head of a given link list here we're going to check if head equals to null if head equals to null we will return null otherwise we will create three pointer current pointer will point to the head node temp pointer will point to the head node and prep pointer will point to null node initially prep pointer will point to the head of reversed linguist now we're gonna run a while loop while current is not equals to null while current is not equals to null we will move temp to the next node to keep track our next node so temp equals to temp dot next here we're gonna connect the current dot next to prep so current dot next equals to prep then here we're gonna move prep to current prep to current and we're gonna move current to temp at the end we'll return the prep because prep will point to the head of reversed linguist always this is the algorithm this algorithm will take big of n time complexity and it will take big of n space complexity for the recursion call stack where n is the number of nodes in the given link list let's see how this algorithm works let's assume we're given this link list this is our head node we're going to initialize current pointer to this head node c for current and temp pointer will point to this node and prep pointer will point to null node here prep pointer will point to this null node current pointer will point to the head and temp pointer will point to the head now we're going to move temp to the next so temp will point to this node we're moving temp to the next because if we connect current dot next equals to prep then this link will be disconnected we cannot access the next node that's why we moved temp to the next node so let's disconnect this connect it to this prep now we're going to move prep to current current to temp pretty simple right temp will point here current will point here we're done with the first iteration let's move to the next iteration current is not equals to null this node value is 2 okay this is not a null node so let's move temp to the next node to keep track the next node let's disconnect let's connect it to this node let's move temp to current current to temp let's move temp to the next right here let's disconnect connect it to this current dot next equals to prep now prep to current and current to temp let's move temp to the next node right here to keep track the next node in this time we see temp is pointing to null node now we're going to connect current dot next equals to prev prev to current and we're going to move current to temp so current will point to this node at this point we see that current pointer is pointing to a null node so we're done this loop will stop we'll just return this prev pointer that means this node we see we have a reverse link list four three two one now four three two one now this is the iterative solution to this problem reverse link list hope you've understood how to solve this problem in the next video we'll see how to solve this problem recursively recursive solution is a bit of tricky see you in the next video